like Anna. Anna? Yep. Nice but to I meet don't you. want um, anything that my family gave me. Yeah. Nothing. Why? Uh, Dale tried to kill me. She told me since the moment I was born that she hated me. She, they tried to kill you? Yeah, my mother did. What the heck? Um, more than once. More she than once? She tried to kill me for being heterosexual. Oh, uh, for being straight? Yeah. Oh, what the heck? What the heck? What the heck? But she paid the two girls who molested my oldest daughter 20 bucks each and told them, thank you for taking care of my girls. What? Mm -hmm. We'll get to that. So, uh, I was born in November of 72. Mm-hmm. And my mother had been uh, trained as a prostitute from the age of four on. Wow. Her daddy um, had prostituted her and her brothers. Mm -hmm. And um, he was horrible. He was, he was a fucking nightmare. And from what I understand, he'd been shot five times in the chest and was still trying to kill the cops when he died. What? Uh-huh. So we believe he was demon-possessed. Um, I don't really remember a whole lot of, of my childhood. Yeah. Just bits and pieces. Yeah. Um... And a lot of things people had to tell me. Yeah. Uh, I think one of the, uh, I think the earliest adventure I had, I was four years old and I had an 18 year old boyfriend. Mm -hmm. four, wait, say it again? I was four years old and I had an 18 year old boyfriend. Where was the parents? Oh, where were your parents again? Um, my daddy left because he had 42 kids. No, but at four, you were like conscious then with that? You were conscious enough to even like. Yeah, well, Dale's what? idea, my mother, her name is Dale. Well, was Dale. Um, but I call her mother, Dale, or Pops. Depends on what mood I'm in. Yeah. But um, mother's idea of sex education, I don't know what a gay woman is doing with heterosexual and porn magazines, but she had a stack of them uh -huh. in her nightstand. Yeah. Right? You know those? Yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah before porn and stuff. Like yeah, yeah. Drawers and shit? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Full of heterosexual wow. uh, porn. Yeah. And, um, she said it's done on her bed, so that's what you do with people you love. Hey, okay, that looks interesting. <laughs> yeah, I'm the same idiot yeah. that when they when she told me not to touch the burner on the stove, I did. Yeah. And then I went, Wow. And then I put my hand back on. Oh. Put it back? I should have fucked it. Wow. Um, but um yeah, I'm a bit of a sadomasochist, I don't know when that started, <laughs> but yeah, it got me into trouble most of my life. But um yeah, I was four. He was 18. We would sniff gas and chew red men together. So I was getting high at four. Yeah. But at two weeks old, I was getting stoned because my mother was putting whiskey, NyQuil, and coffee in my bottles because I wouldn't sleep. Wow. So it was either give me bottles or, or literally kill me because I wouldn't sleep. Yeah. And I asked her one time, why didn't you just abort me? Oh, I didn't believe in abortion. But you believe in murder? Oh, my goodness. I'd rather you had the mercy to abort me, okay? <laughs> Come on. This was a ridiculous. No, anyway, it's too, yeah, that's a good point. Um, I gave him up, though, because he, he, ha he had sex with my six-year-old sister while I was in the room with him. He had what? Sex with my six-year-old sister, my older sister, while I was in the room with them. They were on the bed, and I was on the floor. So the 18-year-old had sex with your six-year-old sister? Uh-huh. While you were there? Uh-huh. Is that dude locked up? No. Where is he now? After Grandma Opal died and um, um, the bar got shut down, I don't know. That guy needs to just be like beat up, shot. Oh, that's not the worst of it. Um, at five, we moved. We were we were already living in Aransas, but we moved back into our house mm -hmm. uh, because my grand my my dad's dad mm -hmm. uh, pay, it caught up the mortgage. Okay, like paid the house off. Yeah, well, because we were his only white kids. Yeah. <laughs> Why do you say the only white kids? What, what, what was? Uh, my dad had a, Mex a wife in Mexico. Oh, okay, okay. And I had four Mexican brothers, but oh. one of them got killed because he was half white. What? Yeah. And my other brothers came over here. I don't know back uh, when, when my daughter was two or three, because I got the blood test to prove they were American. So now they're both American and Mexican. Oh. And they work here, and they live there. Yeah. I don't know how they pull that off, but whatever. Yeah. Um, but uh. <laughs> I miss him. I never really got to talk to him because my older sister fucked it up for me. Wow. Yeah. Um, but uh, I don't care. My husband also helped. Um, but uh, let's see. Okay. You, you do have a... It, it, it is a... It's like you, you could be like a whole movie. But I, I'm sorry that you had to go do that. At one, not only at like such a young age, but to like... I just couldn't imagine like how traumatic that would be like... To be that young and like getting taken advantage of and then like I wasn't considering it as being okay, 
Oh, but the... I wasn't considering it being taken advantage of. Yeah. No. Because for me, it was fun. Yeah. No, because I um. The... I was getting love and affection, and I wasn't getting that in my home life. In yeah. Fact, I, at the age of two, started standing between my sisters and the monsters. Yeah. My mother, her wife, her her women, her my uh, my dad would come over every now and then. He was a fucking. I don't really really remember him coming over, but my mother, my my um. My mother's wife mm -hmm. would lock us in our room mm -hmm. when my dad would come over. And then 30 years later, she married him and tried to kill him. What? Mm -hmm. My mother's wife, after damn near killing all four of us <laughs> and years and years of abuse, like this bitch one time, she left the phone off the hook. Uh -huh. Gail came home, lined us all up for hours, just kept beating her us with our belt. So I admitted that I left the phone off the hook. Just to... Just to make her stop hitting my sisters. Wow. Because you can't hurt me enough to make me quit. But yeah. you can hurt my loved ones enough to make me give in. I, I agree. And um, they use that fucking method I don't know how many times. And now my loved ones blame me for everything and I have nothing to do with them. Fuck it. You want to be... You want to outcast? Outcast yourself. You want to blame somebody? Blame like yourself. Yeah. I don't fucking want nothing to do with any of you. I carried you and now you're worthless. I got more strength than all of you. So I want nothing to do with any of them. Yeah. Sorry. I carried you long enough. I am 50 years old. I deserve to be free. Yeah. I finally got free of domestic violence at 49 a year ago. Wow. May of 2022. I don't say that, that's super sad. I, I, I don't even... I don't know what to say. Like, I'm gonna say congratulations, but I'm also like, I'm sorry. I'm also like, you know. No, love is never wasted. Yeah. And I loved. Yeah. They couldn't. Yeah. They were weak. They couldn't love. I can. Yeah. And even after all their bullshit, I can still love. But that's because God helps me. <laughs> yeah. Because I became evil. Amen. Really, I Amen. became evil. You know, there's a, a saying that goes, "Evil is not born; it's made." Uh huh. And I'm one of the most evil people you'll ever meet in your life. I, 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 not that I don't blame you, but I honestly would be evil too. If I, if I was half the things you would do, I, I would be so mad at the world. I'd be so mad at everybody. I'd be just so mad in general. Like, I just, and that's why not only do you have like an amazing personality, but you're outgoing. Like, you're happy. You're. Oh, it took me years to get here. Yeah. But in the last year, I've made strides because I wouldn't talk about how I felt. Yeah. You give me something to do, tell me what you need, and then get the fuck out of my way and let me get it done. Yeah. And leave me the fuck alone unless you needed me for something. Yeah. Because, dude, my family was a bunch of retards. I'm not saying that to be mean. No, 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 yeah, yeah, yeah. But these people, all they wanted to do was fuck each other over, lie, steal, kill, and destroy. Yeah. I wanted to learn, to build, to make. Yeah. I mean, my dream since I was this idea of grasshopper mm -hmm. was to build a home from the ground up for my family. Uh huh. And I still, to this day, even with all their abuse and all their shit, I still dream of putting them in a home. Yeah. Like, y you've heard of the tiny houses, right? Yeah. My sister's building her own homestead out in Medina Lake. Yeah? Yeah. That's kind of cool. But her husband's got cancer, her car got flipped over, and her other car, the engine got oh blown. Oh, my God. So now she's fucked, and I don't care. I love her. I do. <laughs> but I don't care. <laughs> yeah, yeah. She fucked me over. She had half an ounce of fucking weed in her room. Uh -huh. I had three small joints that I bought for five bucks van handling because yeah. I have no income. Yeah. And I try. I have to rely on God to give me what I asked for. Yeah. Right. Well, she stole my last joint. Wow. I shared two of my joints with her. Told her the last one was for me. Y'all have y'all's. Yeah. I got up, go to the bathroom. I come back. It's gone. She wow. said the dog must have ate it. Oh it was my a, god. Uh, Oh my god. What do you do? Unzip it? Even put a zip bag in my bag? Oh yeah, I can see that. I was like, you got one smart dog, you know? Uh, like, darling, yeah. their dogs are not stupid and they won't touch yeah. marijuana. Every single one of them have. Yeah. And they don't like getting fucked up like that. No, for sure. Dogs, yeah, yeah. And dogs like have it, good noses, yeah. They like it when you blow it in their faces. Yeah. Because they like shotguns. Yeah. But they don't like eating it. Yeah. No, they have good noses. So they, they can tell that it's, you know I mean, something's in the plastic bag and it's not. Dog <laughs> yeah. food, you know what I mean? Like, wow. <laughs> come on. <laughs> but, but um, anyway, 